Welcome back to Passionate About Tech. In this video, I will show you the fastest way to install or update your Intel graphics card drivers to ensure your system is running at peak performance in 2026 by first setting up the official Intel utility, then running an automatic hardware scan to identify your specific driver, and finally performing a clean installation and verifying the update in Device Manager for total stability. Let's get started. First, open your web browser. I have left the direct link to the official Intel support page in the description to make this even easier for you. Once the page opens, look for the big blue button that says Get Started. Click that button to proceed. Next, click the Download Now button to grab the installer. The file is quite small, so it should finish in just a few seconds. Head over to your Downloads folder and double-click the file to open the installer. Check the box to agree to the license terms and click Install. Once the installation is complete, click the Launch button. The tool will open a new tab in your web browser and immediately begin scanning your system to see exactly what is under the hood. It will then list your specific hardware. If a driver is out of date, you will see a clear message saying Update Available. To get the latest software, simply click the blue Download button next to the graphics driver entry. Wait for the progress bar to finish. Once the download reaches 100%, the button will change. Click Install to launch the actual installer. A new window will pop up. Click on Begin Installation to start the wizard. You will then see the license terms. Go ahead and click I Agree to move forward. Now you will land on the final setup screen, showing the components to be installed, like the Intel graphics driver and command center. I highly recommend checking the box for Execute a Clean Installation to ensure any old, buggy files are completely removed. Click Start greater than, and your screen might flicker or go black for a few seconds. Do not panic. That is just the new driver taking over. Once the process finishes, you will see a screen stating, Installation Complete. At this stage, the installer will specifically show a Reboot Recommended message. Even if you feel like skipping it, I strongly recommend you click Finish and restart your computer immediately. A full reboot allows the system to properly initialize the new driver files and clear out the old cache, ensuring total stability. After your computer restarts, it is time to test and verify the update. Right-click the Start button and select Device Manager. Locate the Display Adapter section and click the arrow to expand it. You should see your Intel graphics, like the Intel RHD Graphics 520, listed there clearly. Most importantly, ensure there are no yellow warning triangles or exclamation marks next to it. If it looks clean, you are all set. 